So here we are at Bluehost. We are starting it at $3.95 a month. And instead of clicking on Get Started Now down here, I'm actually gonna have you go up here and click on WordPress Hosting. And I did that just so we can go over a few other points, or a few other, I guess, specials that come with um, the Bluehost package. So with that, you'll have the automatic WordPress install and update and free domain name for the first year, which is huge. So no pressure on picking out the perfect name, it's free. Now we're gonna click on choose plan, and as you can see here, you still have the discounted price of $3.95 a month. All right, so now we are here, and you can see all of the plans you can choose from. We have basic, plus, and choice plus. Now don't get fooled by the recommended sign above here. I wouldn't recommend this, um, actually. This is a lot of stuff um, that you won't even need to be using. But if you're just gonna be doing one website, the $3.95 a month is perfect. You get one website, free SSL certificate, 50 gigabytes of storage, five park domains, 25 subdomains, and a $200 marketing credit. Also, just another tidbit on the free SSL certificate. This is a requirement by Google um, these days, and that's actually the padlock you see up above here. So what that does is it's going to prevent hackers from going into your website. If you don't have that, um, it's going to ruin your rankings, and, and it could be a hazard for your visitors. As for the 50 gigabytes of SSD storage, you would have to work really, really hard to fill that up. I know that I haven't yet and neither has Dear Blogger, so, and we have a lot of information. If I haven't convinced you enough yet, then you can also scroll down the page here and you can see that it has been recommended by WordPress.org since 2005. So, um, without further ado, we are going to go with the basic. And this brings us to the page where the magic happens. You get to create your own domain name. So I'm going to do Krista Brunette, but you can do anything you want. The beauty of this is that it is completely free with the package. So down below here, they are going to try to upsell you on code guard basic and site lock security these are completely unnecessary what i'm going to do is just exit those out and then we get a nice price drop I'm down to 142 dollars and 20 cents it might seem like a lot but this is for the next 36 months so you don't have to worry about those monthly charges you're just going to pay one time fee of 142.20 for the next 36 months. So we are gonna click continue now. And this brings you to your billing and payment information where you're gonna put your email address in, um, where you live, and we're gonna scroll down here. You're gonna click here to accept the purchasing agreement. And before we click purchase now, there is a a secret method that we have found, if you just take your mouse and scroll up to the exit button, ta-da! Did I tell you magic was gonna happen or what? You are gonna get an additional discount. Now you're gonna have it at a cost of $2.65 a month. These savings are insane and you can't pass it up. So let's click get my savings. It's gonna save all of your information in here so you don't have to put it back in. It has your domain name, everything, and then you'd click purchase now and you can also see that your price has now dropped to 95.40. So once you click that, it is gonna take you inside your new account where you can create your website or blog. Awesome work guys, congratulations if you see the success page, you'll get an official receipt here down below, but that's all super boring, and right now we just want to click on create account. No. 
now we can create our Bluehost password, which will log us into your my.bluehost.com dashboard. So this isn't the WordPress password. It's to get you back into Bluehost. And check the box and create account. Now we can click go to login. So welcome guys officially to your Bluehost dashboard. It has a few questions we can answer right now. They want to know your goals so they can recommend some plugins and extensions, yada, yada, yada. So we can say we're creating a blog and it is about, this one's about uh, personal and lifestyle and we're creating it for someone else and continue. Next, we can choose some site additions. So I'm just gonna, for fun, choose about me and resume and not do store for now, but keep the blog, of course, and click continue. And this next step is totally up to you. We're gonna name our site, AKA the site title that appears at the top of our site. And I'm just gonna go with the domain name because that kind of should be your site name. And then the tagline, how about just live life to the fullest? Or maybe living life to the fullest. And are you comfortable with creating websites? Um, but we're going to go with very because we're very comfortable website creators and we have each other. And then continue to theme selection. Okay, so now it's going to say, do you want a free theme? We're going to recommend you these cool ones like Sinatra, Astro, Ocean WP, Hello Mentor. So on and so forth. I've actually clicked through all these before. As you can see, that number gets pretty high down below. Or you can click on premium. Like we said at the start, we have one of the best themes for you, and I want you to learn how to install it the old fashioned way, like designers do. So we're gonna just totally skip this step right here. We're gonna scroll down to the bottom and hit skip. All right, and that was WordPress install. It happened pretty much faster than I've ever seen it in our other videos. So congrats on that. Let's click get started. And we're gonna say, uh, no, we don't wanna charge for this. And we're not gonna turn on a free trial. So just a couple little up charges that we're gonna say no to. And then yeah, here we are guys. So welcome officially to your Bluehost dashboard, which is now fully set up. You should see this cute little web designer person over here, um, ready to deliver a computer to someone. And we're now gonna go to my sites tab. And this is where you could click log in to WordPress or manage it. So let's see what happens if we click manage. It's gonna give us this cool little dashboard saying how many themes we have, plugins, users, and everything's up to date. It's pretty cool. Other features Bluehost offers. Again, we can log in or click view and it'll open in a new tab. And we have our landing page up, which is a coming soon page. So we're gonna take that down pretty soon, but right now this is what Bluehost gives you. So People know you're working on it. Not bad. If we click home, if you don't see your actual domain name right here, what you need to do is go to my sites and click manage and then hit settings. And for your site URL, you can replace this with like anything. So you can actually delete over this site URL and write in a new domain and then save the updates. And of course, if you're writing in a new domain, what you should write in is exactly the domain name you registered and it doesn't need the www. And that will make your domain name start working so when you visit it, you see your WordPress. So cool, WordPress core is on, plugins, themes. There's really no reason to turn this stuff off. Um, if you have any questions, let us know below. But I think now it is time to log into WordPress. So let's click on the blue log into WordPress button. And here we go. All right, guys, welcome to your WordPress dashboard.